Uh, here we go to start this thing. A little uh, stare down. And maybe a show of respect. Why not? Shake their hand. There we go. That's how we need to start a matchup. All right, now that pleasantries have been exchanged, let's tear each other apart. Great sportsmanship to start this thing. Trust me, once the bell rings, respect goes right out the window. This match is underway, and I have to commend them for that display of esteem between these superstars. Yeah, but that can always backfire. You can't always expect the same mutual respect from everyone you meet. You're not totally off base there, Corey. the spine. Thinking about a pin. Two handed choke slam. Look, we know the Undertaker loves to show off his athleticism for such a big guy, but I couldn't see it hurting for him to take this one slow and steady. Fair point, Corey. Undertaker, a master of mind games, a master of doing things on his time. Jumping knee drop. So precise. I think The Undertaker has quite found his opponent's weaknesses yet. Sleeper slam! Oh, look at this. Just crank of the head. That's got to hurt. Just cranking the head. Oh, the knee drop connects. Undertaker facing some trouble. You can bet the dead man won't rest here. And that can be a first step towards the Undertaker gaining control. If Undertaker was looking for a chance to turn this around, this could be it. Counters that with an arm drag. What are you waiting for? Get back in there. You tell him, Saxton. And finds a counter. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Setting foot in the ring now. Going for a power slam, steps down from the line now an inverted DDT. Will this be enough? Oh, somehow he's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of it. Uh-oh. Undertaker cuts him off. Uh-oh. He switches it back around. Elbow right to the head. Undertaker needs to head this assault off at the pass. Any attempts of offense from the Undertaker are being sapped. Loving blows. Just going all out with every blow. The dead man taking a moment to compose himself. Shoulder tackle. He may be in a bad way here. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Tossed around like a rag doll. That just reverberated throughout the entire building. Talk about making a statement. Timely reverb. He's got him down. Is this it? And a kick out at two. He got close there. It could be do or die time. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Oh, God. Uh-oh. Going for the run. The Undertaker showing off his practically supernatural ability in the ring there. He's still got it. Crank in the head. Leg drop. 
Undertaker showcasing his merciless ways. And that's the mastermind at work. Undertaker biding his time, and he's just dominating right now. You can see the battle scars on their bodies, and they are telling an epic tale. These men are showing everyone the desire, the strength, and the will it takes to compete at this level. And get suplexed instead. He's reversing the momentum on him. If he was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Climbs back inside. He beats the count of this one. Continue. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Leg drop. And he's showcasing some dominance here. The Undertaker cannot be stopped. Play it possum! Whoa! Play it possum! And Undertaker barely escapes the pen. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Hooked up. Shin breaker. Undertaker is ready to collect another soul, gentlemen. The time has arrived to rest in peace. Tombstone pile driver. What devastation from the Undertaker. Rope break, pin stops. This is getting intense. Someone check on Saxton. Makes a cover. Almost inhuman at this point. Uh oh. Look at this! Blue Thunderbomb! This has got to be it. This could put a stop to The Undertaker. It does not get much tougher than The Undertaker. And a kick out there is the greatest proof we have seen in this match. That move has brought victory before, but not on this occasion. Might be time to think outside the box. It is beyond electric in here. This energy is on another level. And there was some force on that move. And he's able to reverse. He gets back into the ring. Undertaker going to follow things up with a big splash here. Snake eyes. And then the vintage boot. And leg drop. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. <laughs> what power! Two stone pile driver. The Undertaker just ended this. Good officiating there. Referee seeing him the ropes and breaking the count. Undertaker gets reversed. Undertaker saw it coming. Crashing down hard. He may get the three count right here. This is it. He wins! He wins! Here is your winner. The... You really have to be questioning yourself after a loss like that. You can't dwell, though, Saxton. You've got to take the L and come back with a better plan. If I know them as well as I think I do, that's exactly what's going to happen, Corey. Sometimes being the nice one doesn't pay off. That's all I'm saying. Well, come on, Corey. Being nice isn't about the payoff.
one of the greatest tag teams of all time. The following contest is a triple threat tag team match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 516 pounds, Bret Hart and Jim Neidhart, the Hart Foundation. You would be hard pressed to find a duo in better sync than these two. It all started with a bond formed in the Hart family dungeon. This is gonna be good. And at a combined weight of 506 pounds. The WWE Universe more than ready to see this one start. This is gonna be good. Yeah, now we're talking. And from Japan, weighing in at 187 pounds, the action champion. You know, this person takes some pride in their work, but who could blame them? You are as gifted in the ring as this performer. Wow, you are laying it on thick, Saxton. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll hear you when they watch this match 10 times before bed tonight. The champ does not want anyone making their name at his expense. He plans on fighting hard tonight. Things are about to get good. Weighing in at 216 pounds, the Worldwide Wrestling Continental Champion, Tiger the Mask Man! There's nothing this superstar won't do to win, and the WWE Universe loves it. That's because the crowd knows that this is all that matters to this competitor. Getting the win, reaching the top. Wow! Someone marked down the date. Finally, you spoke some sense, Saxton. Tornado tag with multiple teams facing off. Things are going to get frantic fast. Whatever team comes out of this with their hand raised is going to make a strong case for being the best in WWE. Oh, what a suplex. He turns it around. And he has an answer for Neidhart. Side headlock takeover, nicely done. Tremendous pressure applied. And that was some brutal impact on that DDT. 
What kind of headspace do you need to be successful in a no disqualification match? A ruthless one, Cole. You can't show any remorse about going after your opponent full force. Anytime you waste second guessing yourself, it's time for your opponent to get their hands on a weapon. It goes without saying that there is a certain distinct. Can he score the pen? Oh, baby! And there's the breakup. Just in the nick of time. Oh, a step up in Zagari. He went right into that turnbuckle. Running hip attack. What impact. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the long road. About to be the proverbial one-legged man in the you-know-what kicking contest. Style clash! Back elbow completely cuts them off. Close line! And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He's setting something up. Right down with a DDT. Climbing up to the top now. From the top. And meanwhile, and into the count. Two. No, he pops the shoulder before three. He thought he had it. And the explosion occurring ringside. Oh man, into the neck breaker. Oh. Makes him pay with a counter. Oh, fuck it. Gosh, landing face first. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Oh, suicide dies. Shot. After a shot, they're slamming their face down. The hitman with an excellently executed. This could do it! He breaks up the pin, and Corey, the match continues. I love it. Shutting that down with the back elbow. Quick reaction to Hartman. Victory roll pinning combination. Super kick in the face. So well matched, these men aren't giving up any ground. Showing their strength of will, their refusal to back down. Great cover! And set right into the corner. Oh, perfect kick. Sudden cutoff from Brett. This could be the beginning of the end. Uh oh And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Is Hart going to tap it with the sharpshooter? Wait a minute! What a counter! Vicious right for him. Inverted DDT. What a reversal. Textbook fireman's 
carry takeover. Oh, from behind. Oh, wow. Frankensteiner. Nice. Two. He kicks out at two. How in the world did he kick out? leads the team to victory. This win is huge. I'm sure they'll be posting about this on social media all week long. The greatest king in wrestling history. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Memphis, Tennessee. Weighing in at 235 pounds. Jerry the King Lawler. Love him or hate him, you can't deny his contributions to this industry spanning decades. Yeah, whether inside the ring, at the announcer's table, the King has paved his own very brash path in WWE. Yeah, Byron, but he has the toughness to back up everything he has to say, both in and out of the ring. Always has a trick up his sleeve. Of course he does, Cole. You don't get to be the king for this long without that kind of resourcefulness. One of the most cunning minds in the business. Nobody wants to see you. Get and his opponent from Blackpool, England, weighing in at 240 pounds, William Regal. William Regal is as well mannered as he is conniving, even sadistic at times. How dare you! Regal is a proper gentleman, a real man's man. Regal, a veteran of over 30 years, a truly savvy competitor. One of the masters of the mat, a true villain and a student of our sport, William Regal is gracing us with his presence tonight. Love him or hate him, many of his opponents hate him, Regal never gives less than his best in the ring, and his best is very, very painful. He better be prepared, though, because when the king moves that singlet strap down, it gets nasty real quick. Jerry Lawler is more than happy to kick it old school and hand out a Memphis-style beatdown here in this one. He got whipped into that corner. A funky flip! Punches 
to the ear? How are they gonna hear after this match? Practically never-ending blows coming at full force here. Up the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Perched up top. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. If you're, oh no, getting in position. What's he planning to do here? It's, we're gonna find an escape from the abdominal stretch. Uh-oh, found it. Lawler able to counter. Reversal on top of reversal. And Lawler took a solid shot. I'm having flashbacks to when I hit Jerry that hard. <laughs> yeah, William Regal showed a solid game plan there. Hitting the edge of the ring like that can do some lasting damage to the body. Smart strategy, attack the knee. Regal flex. That brilliant mind of William Regal on full display there. Producing a trampling. Boom, knee drop right on target. Regal looks to be in control here. Yeah, somehow Lawler has to turn the tide. Oh, elbow right to the bread basket for their troubles. Whip back into the ring. And Regal is countered. Straight impact on the throat. to the gut. And a stamp right. Lawler with a stamp on this one. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. is giving it right back. And now gets tossed into the ring. And the cover for the win. This is it. Oh, he got him on a win.
Here is your winner, Jerry the King Lawler. And the victor, Jerry Lawler. The King's reign rolls on. One thing about Jerry Lawler, the King knows how to win. Shaking hands, yeah. center of the ring, and here we go. May the best man win. Look, I think we are in store for a hard-fought matchup between these two superstars. There's the battle. We've already seen the respect these superstars share for each other. That kind of respect is something that can take a superstar to the next level in their career. Oh, come on, Saxton. In WWE, you got to hit first, or you'll be the one getting hit. That's gonna keep you unsteady. The bigger you are, the more weight your knee has to support. And he's out of there. Uh-oh. Oh, straight to the floor. Really thought that was gonna work, but now we got a human being we have to scrape off the floor. Oh, from behind. Oh, wow. Frankensteiner. Nice. Toss back into the ring. Undertaker. It's going for the Dragon Sleeper. And he's able to fend off what must have been a grueling submission. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. According to the Undertaker, has proven for decades now that he can put his opponents away, sometimes for good in so many ways. The mental game, his agility, his power. What do you think he should focus on in this one? Above all else, Colt, the power game is where The Undertaker excels. No need to fix what isn't broken, especially when you left the kind of path of destruction that he has. Basement drop kick. Kick! He moved, but can he capitalize? Saw it coming, and responds with a counter of their own. into the pin. Power right out and one. Still has enough energy for the simple kick out. Uh-oh. Somehow he saw Taker coming. He's stalking his opponent from the... Taking flight. Good Lord. Taking flight. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Cheating necessary when well, you can pull something off like that. I think mean, the fuse has been lit here, guys. Yeah, Saxton. Now we'll see if this is dynamite or a dud. Oh, what a knee strike. He's heading back to the ring. Eddie Guerrero just mocking his opponent now. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. Brutal boot. Eddie able to defend against that. Boom! Boot! Nice! Got the leg and dropping the elbow right on the knee. And that move looks to have turned the heat up on Guerrero. Taker bringing forth another unholy attack there. He gets out of the way. Placed in the corner.
corner. And a reversal by Guerrero. From the middle rope, a breathtaking Hurricane Rana. Takes their breath out. Effective counter. the W, The Undertaker wins it. Here is your winner, The Undertaker! There's a great victory. When you're a class act like that, no one is going to hate it when you win. Absolutely, Corey. This is a big win for sure. And being able to walk out of the ring with your head held high is a good feeling too. Things are about to get just too sweet. The OC is here and ready to have each other's backs. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the OC from Gainesville, Georgia. Weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ. You know you are in for an all-out fight facing the OC. A high in-ring IQ, high intensity, and high goals to achieve. The OC commands respect wherever they go, and their opponents had better be ready to show it. Certainly earn the respect, and they'll take it from anyone who won't give it willingly. The big, strong boy. And his opponent from Dudley, England, Weighing in at 175 pounds, Tyler Bates. This is a man who captured the NXT UK Championship as a teenager. <laughs> yeah, and he's only gotten better since. Same fighting spirit, but stronger and smarter than ever. Bates, the first NXT UK Triple Crown Champion, NXT UK Champ, Tag Champ, and NXT Heritage Cup Champion. Big, strong boy vibes all day. No weak link in his game. A true example of British strong style.
Throughout his illustrious career, one word is best described AJ Styles. Phenomenal. A single word that tells you everything you need to know about this man. Against all odds, even against the most nefarious forces, AJ Styles has consistently risen to the top. It's that sort of determination that has earned AJ accolades the world over. We'll see if AJ lives up to that phenomenal moniker here tonight. That brings us to Tyler Bate, a UK standout who is one of the top stars in this industry across the pond. Now he's ready to carve out his place in the WWE history books. Bate has already accumulated a ton of accolades throughout his career, and I'm sure he has no plans of slowing down anytime soon. The big, strong boy has all the skills and ambition he needs to be a serious threat to any opponent. The foot DDT! Ooh, that got turned around on Styles. And a reversal by Tyler Bate. Snap suplex. Very nice. Escapes in a nick of... No! Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Face, meat floor. I think I see a few teeth on the floor. A uh, slingshot, boom, with a forearm. Throwing all costs into the wind and leaping to the outside. Good timing with that reversal. There's a certain cockiness that AJ Styles carries into the ring. At times, you've seen that beat him before his opponent gets the win. Is that going to be a problem for AJ here, Corey? Well, there might be a certain cockiness to AJ's attitude, but he has the ability to back that up. As long as he hasn't underestimated his opponent in the ring, AJ should have a solid showing here. The referee counted, urging them to get in the ring. No, they beat the count. Just barely. Nicely done, snap suplex, so quick. He's on his heels a bit now. That was one way to get things phenomenally done. Enough already. And here's a cover. Big kick out. Able to squeeze that shoulder out, so close. of reversals here. Both superstars clearly studied game tape ahead of time. He takes control. Into the ring again. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Stiff elbow will break that up. Strength with the German. He's getting a little battered now. Hard hitting damage coming from Bay. Oh, oh, it's it cinched in. We're gonna free the arm and does just that. Uh oh. Tough position to be caught in here. Can't prepare your face for that. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Oh, look out. Oh, 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 oh. Nice shot right across the back of the neck. Ouch. It's incredible the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Taking it outside the ring now. for yourself as well. That's the off into the pin. Two. No one kick out for AJ Styles. He really thought that was it. Oh, bop and bang. Oh, he fights bait back. Styles looking for it. And he's in the rope. Save him there. But will he be able to last much longer? A 
tough loss handed to Tyler Bate. I guess the big, strong boy just didn't have it in him tonight. He either wasn't big enough or strong enough, or both. Uh, referee calls to the bell. We're underway, and the referee goes down just oh, like no. that. It's a hazardous environment for an official. And can the match continue? The ref took a nasty fall. We knew this was going to get out of hand. I didn't realize it was going to happen this quickly. We need to restore some sort of order. The bell rings coming right off the heels of some underhanded tactics. We all know just how much a calculated attack like that could affect the course of this match. Getting a leg up on the competition is the name of the game, Saxton. Work smarter, not harder. Warrior able to counter. Oh, look at the squeeze. It's on like a vice grip. Oh, that just looks nasty. Boom! And now thrown back into the ring. thrown around like a sack of you know what. Ah, oh, and he stays ahead of Warrior. That'll turn your lights out. Elbow drop. Piercing. This match grinded him down a little. Yeah, Savage broke him down there. Corey, what do you think Warrior's thinking about as it pertains to this matchup? I'd well, never attempt to enter the mind of the Ultimate Warrior, but looking at history, Warrior's goal is to unleash chaos in that ring and focus it against anyone who dares oppose it. Lift off, diving hammer strike, the cover. Almost two and a half. Close call, that was almost lights out. Oh, he retaliates. Oh, flapjack! Gosh, landing face first. Hoist it up. Suplex! Oh, set fly. Can he score the pin? And he kicks out at two. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Look out! Suicide dive to the outside. Cole does it better. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spitting in the face of Whoa. danger. And just an uncalled for underhanded attack there. And landing with the double axe handle. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Oh, flapjack. And will this be it? And he breaks the count quickly. He's not even close to being done yet. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Check your face after that one. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. 
Inverted atomic drop. Ooh. Enable the counter. Look over the front waistline. But able to block into an arm drag. Big four. He saw it coming. Got that suplex. Making it look easy. Climbing up top. He's got big plans. Up high. Axe handle from the middle rope. Sight set on the top rope. Continuing to dissect the leg of his opponent. Oof. So much damage inflicted. Warrior counters. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm. Lands the knee. Not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Big leg drop. He's starting to struggle here. You know, Warrior is still on the warpath after that move. Solid punch. Ah, oh, that got turned around on Randy. Oh, what a close line. Here's Nope. Here comes the Warrior from the ropes. Big splash. Absolute dominance from the Warrior. Sure. This is when you have to switch game plans. You can't let yourself get discouraged. And Warrior has to be asking the heavens, is it time to step aside? Do I have what it takes to defeat this man? I don't know how there's... Here comes the Warrior. Uh-oh. Blocked it. The knees up could provide a huge turnaround. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. No, no, no. Oh, no. Crashing hard onto the floor. Paying the price of treating your own body like a human crash test dummy. Gouging the face. A ripping and tearing at the face. Randy devising some. Uh oh. Hits him with the counter. Anything can happen in WWE, and this audience is seeing that firsthand. The entire WWE Universe is going to have to pick their jaws off the floor after this one's done. Warrior encouraging his opponent to bring everything he has. It's over. Ultimate Warrior's done it. Here is your winner. The Ultimate Warrior. I don't see how you can't be disappointed in winning like this. And how can you even celebrate a win as tainted as this one? Tainted? How? Oh, come on. You saw the blatant cheap shot, Corey. All I saw was the drive to win at any cost, which they just did, mind you. And to that, I say kudos.
Here they come. This is going to be an all-out war. These two won't even wait for the opening bell. The official desperately trying to, trying to separate these two, but I'm not sure that's going to be possible. Well, tensions have already boiled over. We haven't even had the bell yet. Tried to catch the superstar Ooh. off guard, but they were prepared. Yeah, these two did not want to wait for the bell, but the referee finally able to get things under control. Clearly a lot of hostile feelings between these superstars who couldn't even wait for the match to begin before getting their hands on each other. But should we really be going through with this match after what happened before the bell? Well, if you want to go stand in the way of these superstars, go for it. Before I'm sitting, it doesn't look like there's any stopping them. Oof. Back stops to the gut. Putting the boots to an opponent will take the fight out of them in a hurry. Here it is! Across the top rope, what a hot shot. Finn Balor is an extraordinary athlete. You have to think that will play a part in his strategy here, right, Corey? Finn can literally wrestle circles around anybody. It's why he prefers it when matches go long. As long as Balor doesn't give his opponent too much breathing room, he'll be able to adjust on the fly. Dodges out of the way. Some good contact by Dusty Rhodes. Oh, what a strike to the back. Balor possibly being reminded there that it will take a lot more to dismantle his opponent. And dropped. Rhodes just looking to humiliate his opponent. Stay in this. Not yet. Oh my goodness. Devastating elbow. That kick will stop you in your tracks. Placing them into the corner. An elusive Rhodes there. Beautiful hip toss. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. Shoulder tackle. Shifts it back onto him. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Put in a position now. Ooh, right to the throat. And it's Balor, who looks like he's a little worse for wear after that hit. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Mm. Quick oh. strike to the lower body. Kick lands. Oh, from the rope. Gets out of there in a hurry. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by countout. He can do it here. Whoa. Thrown back in under the ropes. Stomping down. Trying to debilitate the capability to stand. Kick right to the gut. And he was able to turn that around on Balor. Oh, man. Focusing their attack on the arm and all pride. Well, that came to an end with a rough punch. Oh, 1916. He can end it here. He's got him. And a kick out at two. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Boom! A forearm smack! He's absorbing some tough hits now. Yeah, because Finn knows just when to shift into that more dangerous gear. Oh my goodness, what an impactful STO!
Just a ruthless streak for the world to see. And that was a first-hand example of a dirty attack. Whoa, not quite yet. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Balor with 15, 16. Balor could take this one. The cover. And they're still in this. Man, oh man, what resilience. He's got to be running on instinct alone. And you have to ask, will Balor remain undaunted towards the task at hand? And now the gears are really turning for Balor. Finn wrestling circles around his opponent at this juncture, giving zero breathing room for this guy to formulate a counter strategy. Bad predicament right here. Oh, God, face first. A running slap. That's just insulting. And this has got to be it. Kicks out. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Ow! Foot, meet back. And Balor is back on the receiving end of the attack there. The American Dream teeing up for the series of bionic elbow. Makes the Balor's in deep peril here. Oh, he was almost finished. It not only takes strength to kick out there, it takes willpower. And Balor is... Watch out. What? You want to talk about putting it all on the line? Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Ah, oh, Balor with the counter. Finn finding a way to slow his opponent's assault down. Finn showing it's not a time for lying down, it's a time for fighting back. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. This has become a monumental struggle for these competitors. It is down to who still has the energy, the resolve, to put the pedal to the metal. The referee continues the count, may call it soon. Finn Balor has his sights set. It's over, and Finn Balor is your winner. Here is your okay. winner. He is and not going to let him make a mockery of things. Well, despite an attack that was intended to prevent this very outcome, we have our winner. Definitely a hard-won victory. Would have been a slightly easier win without that unexpected attack. Well, let's just focus on the positives here. Uh, here comes the gold medalist. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 237 pounds. A man who will take on any competitor on any night. Yeah, Kurt Angle considers the entire locker room an open challenge.
And here comes one of my favorites. And his opponent from Aberdeen, Washington, weighing in at 210 pounds, Brian Danielson! Just look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger. Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? A little advice for this superstar. Do not attempt to try to go hold for hold with Angle because the wrestling machine knows every counter. Incomparable technical in-ring skills, a surprising vicious and competitive streak. Kurt Angle has all the tools to get a definitive win here tonight. He is what he says he is. He is a wrestling machine. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Angle is not going to make things easy for the competition here. But across the way is a man who's rededicated his focus. Someone who's been spending extra time training and scouting for his competition. He's got him scouted. Oh my gosh! Going right after the neck! Neck breaker! Counters! Oh, look at this. Out to the apron. Oh my goodness! Are you kidding me? Back suplex on the apron. A collision like that could mark a turning point for this entire match. Angle gets the better there. Oh, man. Kurt Angle might be one of the most skilled Mac technicians in WWE history. How can an opponent even begin to formulate a plan against this wrestling machine? I think you answered your own question there, Cole. Don't grapple with Kurt Angle. You absolutely need to stay out of his grip and avoid takedowns. If you can manage that, Angle's frustration will rise and you may find an opportunity. Have to head back into the ring now. Yeah, count's running out. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. We could have been looking at a count out there. Yeah, you just know that would have been a deflating result for the WWE Universe. Great body control. Is it enough here? He narrowly avoids the count. Couldn't quite slam the door yet. Measured knee drop. Beautiful gator roll. Great way to disorient your opponent. Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Coquina clutch! Locked in! Ah, oh, rotates out and gets the cover. He kicks out with authority. I suppose you have to take the shot, but it's still too early to wrap up this one just yet. Deliver an attack with intentions of cutting down their base. to get the advantage here. Oh, right suplex. And shoulders are down. Two count, barely kicks out. The end was in sight. Yeah. Wow, he reversed angle. What a wrist clutch suplex. Able to
to elude it. He is delivering elbow after elbow. He just barely dodges. Exploder! He's returning fire. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Angle switches it up. Oh, a moonsault. Suplex. Vicious right forearm. Oh, had it scattered and met with a back elbow. Kurt Angle picks the leg. Looking to end this here. The ankle lock is in. The official asking him, is he going to tap? Is he going to tap? And he chooses to let go of the hold. But just the amount of time he was in that submission. He could pin his opponent. Right here! It's over. Kicking out in time. So, so close. That could have been it. He's going for it all. Uh-oh. Way too... Uh -oh. Showing why he's a wrestling machine, Olympic gold medalist. Big time offense from Angle, guys. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Targeting a body part, working the arm. Crushed with a running knee strike. And just check out the face of Angle after that. Two count, three, no, two count. I cannot believe that kick out, gentlemen. Somehow, Kurt Angle is still alive. Such heart being shown by Angle. Tonight. Listen, that should have ended things. And look at his face. At this point, you have to believe he's losing some faith in himself. Flying. Rough landing. What a punch. Boom! What a right. Oh, one step ahead of Angle. It's been an elacious encounter this far. The tides have swung in multiple directions. It's anyone's guess how this one's gonna end. Ankle lock. An agonizing hole to be caught in. Will it? Finally ends it. And all the bloodshed. Perhaps worth it now. Here is your winner. Kurt Angle! Another big win here for Kurt Angle. The Olympic gold medalist doing what he does best, gentlemen, winning.
the Hall of Famer, the most dominant female competitor ever. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Redondo Beach, California, the ninth wonder of the world. No nonsense superstar. Yeah, China doesn't mess around. She just messes others up. And maybe she'll mess you up while she's out here, Saxton. There's no denying China has forged a legacy that stands the test of time. Truly the ninth wonder of the world. The raiding party has arrived. Here comes destruction. And her partner, representing the Viking Raiders, Valhalla. The Viking Raiders approach the ring every night as if it's a battlefield, and they fight accordingly. Yeah, holding back is apparently not in the Viking playbook. But intimidation certainly is. These warriors are a scary sight. If there's glory to be won, they'll burn this whole place to the ground to get it. For many, the day the Viking Raiders graced their arena was the most important day of their life. But for the Raiders, it was Monday. is a superstar who can breathe new life into this crowd. They were already alive, Cole. I don't know how this superstar is going to do anything to change that into being more alive. Yeah, Corey, but the fearless and daring behavior we see from this superstar brings the WWE Universe to an entirely new level. Just take a look at the champ. Always an event when she competes. And from Yamaguchi, Japan, the International Wrestling Grand Prix Women's Champion, Ian Tammy My Doom. The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. She treats every match like a title defense. That's how she got to this point in her career. Some good old-fashioned tag team action here. 
There's such a distinct attribute that makes a tag team successful. It's an indefinable quality. We're about to see which one of these teams possesses that X factor here. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. Oh, Matt Slam with some attitude. She turns it around. Back elbow smash. Nothing. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Well, I'm not sure she can escape by this. And yes, she does. Turns the tides. Good defense. Up and down. What a slam. There's a tag. Down to one knee. Shiny wizard. Oh, there's the old stump puller uh, leg snap. Uh, that's going to hurt. Tear your hamstring. Tag it. on Valhalla. Cross body. Yeah. Arm drag takedown. <laughs> nice arm drag. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Bahala got met with some ruthlessness that time. Monster set up in the corner. Bahala able to reverse. Bulldog. That maneuver goes to show you how much speed kills. Turning the tables. He is looking to do some serious harm. Followed by an overhead kick. Bam. Super kick. That's a tag. can flatten you. For the record, Saxton, you and I would never have that kind of chemistry. Hey, I'd be a great teammate. I've seen you trip over your own... Her shoulders are down! Win! A big win! That took a huge effort! Here are your winners. An emphatic victory for your winners. An impressive effort from this duo. The wrestling gods have truly blessed this union. I fully expect to see more showings like this going forward from this duo.